just like the the the, the balloon said, let's get wasted tonight. Let's get wasted. Well, I guess this is the little side of me that you haven't seen before. I drink, smoke, dancing with hot chicks. All of that happens in my birthday. How is it? Uh, my birthday is actually on the 24th of March, but the party was in 25th of March. Yeah, so uh, it's actually I I started doing this since last year's birthday. Uh, I have this mission and vision to celebrate my birthday in the right way, sharing love and kindness, and you know, help those who needs. And I chose to share it with an orphanage in Bali. It's called the uh, Salam Tabanan Orphanage. So we took all the kids to the zoo, and yeah, it was it was it was magical. It was very sweet because. They never been to zoo before, so yeah, I'm just very grateful to be able to share this experience with 35 kids, I think. 35 kids, and there's also like two stuff of them, and a lot of my close friends also joining in the zoo trip. And yeah, it was very memorable because it's, I just feel right, you know, it's celebrating your big day in the right way. Btw, maaf kepotong dikit ada promosi karena di video ini ada giveaway-nya. Buat yang pengen giveaway baju semesta, lumayan nih buat lebaran. Ada berbagai macam baju dengan berbagai macam warna, kalian bisa pilih sendiri. Yang mau menangin giveaway-nya harus nonton video ini sampai habis ya. Also one more thing on my birthday on 24th of March, I was able to flew my dad on a trip to Mecca. It's a big dream come true for me because that's always my uh, one of my biggest mission and goal to actually be able to uh, bring my dad or like send my dad on a trip to Mecca. If you're Muslim, you would understand. He's supposed actually he's supposed to go on the 19th of March, but because of something, the agency and the trip schedule. They postponed it until the 24th of March, which is wow. It's just and like it's a big gift for me seeing my dad flew to Mecca and finally made his dream come true. And yeah, it's great because it's not only his big dream but also my big dream. So yeah, that 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 what happened in 24th of March. Yeah, the bir the party was on twenty fifth. <laughs> the party. Well, um, I I like in my life I never celebrate a birthday before, and I'm quite a shy person. You know, I'm like quite introverted. Especially the last two years, I've been very like being this close book person and I'm really focusing on myself. And also pandemic hit, so that really helps me to be more introverted. To be able to like, you know, have the courage to open my door again to a lot of people and a lot of strangers that I don't know that night also came. I don't know who invited them. But yeah, yeah, I was nervous. I was nervous on the 25th because my first time um, throwing a party, I have to arrange everything and yeah, so I want it to be special for sure. It's like once in a lifetime experience. But this year I pick a team uh, costume party. So everyone have to wear costume either it's like iconic character or like famous figure or just anything fun and you know like a festival carnival kind of costume i i was surprised because because like um i thought people will not do such effort to wear costume but they really they were really like like wearing things and for me it was kind of hard to find the one because i want to be like i want to look special at night. i want to look like a king or like queen or like I'm the one, you know, I'm the one who's having the, having the night. So I kind of like try to find some options until I got the one, which was Maleficent. But I think it's also like represent me a little bit. You know, I'm like Aries and Maleficent kind of like Aries person, you know, very strong, brave and like don't give a shit about things and mystical, but sweet, very sweet inside and very lovable. Yeah. So. I think I picked the right costume. Maleficent. Oh. 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 Oh.
Uh, struggle for sure. Finding a villa was really hard, like a lot harder than we thought. I thought you know renting Airbnb villas would be like easy, but no, because it's like big party. I invited around like 50 of my close friends, and strangers came that night too. Um, so yeah, uh, when I ask about uh, is it okay to throw a party, blah 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 blah, and most of them say no, it's not okay. The neighbors around are like they want to be quiet, and you have a, have to do a permit to the local community, and blah 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 blah. So it took a while, and it's like nerve wracking because we got the villa in like I think three days before the party, right? Which was crazy, but finally we found the one. Huge villa, five bedrooms, huge garden, huge pool, huge living room, everything just beautiful. It's kind of expensive though. Because <laughs> like, you know, um, a normal rate in that villa is six million a night. But we were like throwing a party which needs like a security deposit and like a permit to the local community. And yeah, a lot of extras. And yeah, in total we paid 13 million yeah. for the night. <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty crazy. Besides that, I decided to just go all in for like a really great party. So we hired a DJ, which cost a lot of money too, for performing three hours <laughs> that night. And also uh, a photo booth. That one is fun and like very unhappy with that decision. And also like a uh, chef. He, da he did the barbecue live cooking in front of us and a lot of foods and drinks, a lot of drinks, a lot of drinks and bartender and securities and cameraman and videographer so yeah, that's a lot of money guys it's a lot of money yeah, until everything, everything was ready the villa is ready, the party is ready and let's open the gate I feel like Queen Elsa into the end, no. <laughs> yeah, so an hour after the gate opened, there were like one or two person. I, I was nervous, like honestly, I was like, mm, where's everyone? Like, but then time by time, everyone's coming, and minute by minute, everyone starts. They, they came, they came, like they just came late, but like everyone I invited were there. Yes, I get a lot of gifts. I didn't expect that actually. Most of them give me gifts and yeah, I'm like, yeah, I'm happy. Thank you guys. Almost everyone were wearing like like really like a costume and some of them were like crazy like like Cleopatra and Piraun I love that one Kevin I remember he wore a squid game that one is cool Satyawini were like the like a devil sexy devil the Gojek driver Cam my best friend the Gojek driver well that that killed me that night oh my manager we win Dora the whore she said Oh, it's it's a little hard, but I have to say, hola. Yeah, she wears the Mrs. Smith, like pop, some some people say PUBG, PUBG. She actually hired a fashion designer from Java to make that costume. And wow, I'm like, damn. Yeah, so hola, wow. You win the, the best costume, I guess. Any drama? Yeah, there's other one, which was the DJ came late. And it was it was nerve wracking because everyone started to come. Maybe probably already like fifty people there. Um, I'm like, whoa, where is the DJ? I need to start the music. You know, I need to have everyone to start dancing and having fun. 
But um, lucky me, it was like it was a cool night. So everyone started to mingling with each other. They see each other after like a while. They haven't seen each other because we'll, we'll have a lot of mutual friends. And we have foods, unlimited foods, unlimited drinks. So it's like eating and drinking and just talking. And yeah, I guess it wasn't a drama because. Also to kill the time because the DJ came late, I ended up doing a speech. I want to say huge thanks to all of you. This is like my, my very first time celebrating a birthday. I never, never in my life celebrating a birthday like a throwing a party. So I, I don't know what to do. I don't know what school. I don't know what music to play. But, but then uh, lucky yes, when I did the speech, the DJ came. So it was the right timing. So I, I want to say huge thanks to all of you guys for coming here, for making such an effort to dress up for like, you know. Oh! Oh! Yeah, again, I, all of you guys are like my close friends that I feel like I'm really connected to. So I'm really thankful and grateful. Oh! To my, yes. um, thank you so much for, for coming, for dressing up, for being in my life. And Don't cry! Okay, I just, yeah, that's it, that's all. I just want to say thank you so much for coming. Oh, yeah, why not? Bro? This, I, bro, I've been working on for the last two years. For tonight, it's just like the, 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 the balloon say, let's get wasted tonight. Let's get wasted. Everyone starts to give me drinks, drinks, and drinks, and tequila shot. So yeah, I was I was pretty wasted that night. I'm sorry, mom and dad, if you're watching this, I was so drunk in my birthday, and yeah, once in a lifetime, right, mom and dad, right? Not only me, a lot of my friends are wasted too, especially Rob, <laughs> right? Rob, you were wasted. Well, I have to say that's like that was like the best birthday ever in my life. My 28th birthday. It's like I've never done birthday party before. I I don't celebrate birthday. I'm again I was pretty close book until that day I decided to open my door to a lot of people and it opened my eyes. It's not only about the fun of the party, seeing my lovely friends and best friends dancing together, eat together and be grateful of being together. But also like being an introvert person and doing all these things is like huge for me. Take my hand, lead you home. I don't think I have to close my door anymore. It's like it's the time. It's the time to open my door for a lot of people that comes into my life. Turn down the lights tonight. So I have a bigger opportunity, bigger chance to grow, to learn, 
to find new people, new circle that can help me improve and growing. Yes, thank you to everyone that came to my birthday. I'm very grateful to have all of you guys. Much, much love for you guys, for all of us. Nah ini dia yang ditunggu-tunggu buat teman-teman yang pengen ikutan giveaway Caranya gampang banget Yang pertama kalian harus follow akun-akun di bawah ini Yang pertama at backpacker tampan Yang kedua at semesta.bytampan Yang ketiga at tampan films Kalau nggak follow nggak akan bisa menangin Karena kita akan cek satu persatu Syarat yang kedua tinggal komen di bawah ini nih Di video youtube ini Menurut kalian siapa yang menggunakan the best costume that night dan alasan juga kenapa Syarat yang ketiga Tinggal share link youtube ini Atau video youtube ini Di instastory kalian Jangan lupa mention At backpacker tampan Semua syarat berlaku Dan kita akan memperhatikan semua syarat Akan ada tiga pemenang Yang masing-masing mendapatkan Satu buah baju semesta Plus satu buah full pack Video preset Atau foto preset Dari tampan films Thank you so much for watching this video And I will see you guys In the next vlog Which is Singapore Yes Singapore is open guys